camera view of the repair work site. Now one hour and 10 minutes into today's spacewalk. Okay, most of what I see in the cavity, I see milk core pond exposed. I see the uh, silver bar. That is the, the, the stretch brownish uh, fibers. If you see some torn RTV, the RTV does appear to still be bonded to the bottom of the blanket. And it appears that it stops about midway to the, what's referred to as the uh, new white looking tile. Now, if you guys can pick that up on WVS or not. Okay, very nice. New San Atlantis, are you receiving uh, EV2s, WVS? Atlantis, we are receiving the image. Thank you. Okay, pan left slightly. Okay, that's enough on uh, WVS. This is Mission Control Houston, now one hour and 15 minutes into today's spacewalk as astronaut Danny Olivas is documenting the thermal protection system uh, blanket on the orbital maneuvering system pod here. Astronaut Jim Riley is on the outside of the Destiny Laboratory module working on removing a water vent on the outside of that, uh, of that component of the space station. After re removing that vent, he will install a hydrogen vent to uh, different component that will be used for the oxygen generation system inside the U.S. segment of the complex. Okay, we copy. Okay, Danny, go ahead and pan left, and we're getting good WVS. Pan left. Come in left. Look down. Tilt down. Good. Keep panning left. That's enough down. Just keep going. That's good motion. Tilt down. Tilt down a little more. Go all the way. Keep going. A little more to the left. That's about it. Okay, tilt down some more. Okay, we got it. All right, it all looks good. It's uh, well below. Okay. Drew, I'd like to yaw to the left. Just slightly. Um, yaw left slightly. Yes, please. Are we ready to manipulate the blanket on the damage site? Can't say again, Danny. Are you ready for the damage blank manipulation? Yes. Here it goes. As you do it, I'm just going to remind you that you're starting from the fold line and working towards the lifted corner. You flatten the blanket flush or self-flush to the tile OML using your gloved hand. Now one hour and 30 minutes into today's spacewalk, this helmet camera video showing the work being done by astronaut Danny Olivas to tuck a thermal protection system blanket down on the orbital maneuvering system pod of the Space Shuttle Atlantis. Okay, Pat, I think that's complete. Nice job, Danny. It looks like uh, that it uh, indeed uh, has got memory such that it uh, stays in place below the OML. It does. I will tell you right now that it's, it's one step along the seam here. When I folded it down, it, it felt like the satchel or the, uh, the quartz batty on the inside was uh, kind of punching up, so it's a little bit, a little bit tougher to push down along the seam here. Yeah, and you can massage that a little bit. 
that, you know, we thought you might have to massage it such that you pushed it a little closer together, but if you need to, just kind of massage that area and get it lower, you can. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty happy with what I see. Okay, uh, we've got a good view of that and we're happy to. Hi, Danny, I think what we're going to move on to is the uh, stapling. Copy that. Now, obviously, there's some warnings that go along with that, and so just would ask that you would remember those that we went over with as far as the sharp edges and the distance uh, from the stapler. Roger that. So I'll put that into work right now. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try and open up a groove here. That's right. You can use the tip of an equipment hook and just separate those edges. And that will allow to get a lower row of staples in there. Copy that. A reminder, Danny, there's 15 to 18 staples in each one of those staples you're carrying today. Copy that. We need at least eight uh, on the lower. Eight on the lower and ten on the top, right? That is correct. All righty. Put that in work. Atlantic Houston, Big League for EDA. Go ahead, Megan, for EDA. Pat, um, we'd appreciate it if Danny could give us some words about the filler bar and verify that the filler bar is not preventing him from stapling the blankets together. Olivas has completed the lower row, the first row of staples between the seams of these two blankets, now uh, tucking the blankets together to complete a second row of staples on the top. <laughs> 